part 6, higher purchase. You will find this on page 58 in the Namibia Mathematics Grade 9 textbook, Y equals MX plus C to success. The total amount paid is the deposit plus the installment multiply the amount of months. This is how we work out higher purchase. But let's just look at an example. Look at the advertis advertisement of Fermat Spring Festival Specials and answer the following questions. What is the cash price of the fridge? So look, now there is the cash. That is the cash price of the fridge, 2799. Okay, what is the percentage discount? So basically, I just take these two values and I subtract that. And if I subtract, I get 300. And then I take the 300 and I put it over to make it a percentage over the original 3099 and then multiply by 100%. And that's giving me 9.68%. And then number C, how much will you pay for the fridge if you buy it on higher purchase? Now we will come to this formula. So the deposit, look, there is the deposit, okay, plus there is the installments, 243, and then multiply the amount of months, 24. And then if I add it up, I'll get 6392. And then number D, what is the percentage increase on the price of the fridge bought on higher purchase? So then it's this one, the 6392, this one, which I got there, minus the original one. That's giving me that total of increase. But to make it a percentage, I put it over the original one, the 3099. Then I multiply by 100%, and that's giving me 106.3% more. Okay. I want you to do, let's just move it up a little bit. I want you to do try now eight number two. You can stop the video, and as soon as you are finished, you can continue with the video. Try now eight. Let's start. Number A. This is also a spring special. Look at the advertisement and answer the questions. Okay, there is the advertisement. What is the cash price of the washing machine? Okay, so let's start. The cash price of the washing machine, that is, you see this cash, there it is. So the cash price is 2399. That is the cash price. Okay, then I'm, I'm going to look at the next one, number B. Okay, let's just check that one. Okay, so in number B, I'm going to, to ask you, what is the percentage discount for cash? Now, I just subtract that too, so I'm going to take 2599, and I subtract 2399, and that's giving me a difference of $200. Okay, and then I'm taking this $200, and I put it, over the original one, the 2599. And then to make it a percentage, I multiply it by 100%. And that's giving me an answer of 7.7% discount. Okay. And then number C, what will you pay for the washing machine if you buy it on higher purchase? So let's just look higher. Remember, it's always the deposit plus, and then it's the installment times the months. Okay, so what is the deposit? Look, 480. Now, what is the installment? That is, there it stands, 281. And then I'm multiplying it by 18. And then it's going to give me a total of 5538. Five, okay. And then number D, the last one. What is the percentage increase on the price of the washing machine if you buy it on higher purchase? So I must work with this amount and with the one it was. So I will take this 5. Okay, let's just, let's just give it a name. So to find the difference, 
I will take this 5, 5, 3, 8, and I will subtract the 2, 3, 9, 9. And I will get an amount of 3, 1, 3, 9. Okay, let's just move it up a little bit. And now to make it a percentage, I will take that 3, 1, 3, 9, and I put it over the original one. That's the top one. So it's 2599, nine, and to make it a percentage, I multiply by 100%, and that will give me 120.8%. So the percentage increase, the percentage increase is 1.2%. 0.8%. Okay, and that's how you do it.